What's up YouTube, Maggie Tutorials here. Today I'm going to show you how to boot into safe mode in Windows 8. In previous versions of Windows, all you had to do was smash the F8 key and it would eventually boot up into safe mode. But now in Windows 8, it boots into some weird recovery mode where you can like recover your files without restoring Windows 8 and so it's basically impossible to do it in the normal method. The way to boot into safe mode that I found the easiest was by going onto the desktop itself. So if you're having issues with booting the computer, then try holding shift and F8. But when I did it, I couldn't get it to go past my BIOS boot screen, so every computer might be different, but I'm going to be going into the desktop to do it. So let me show you how. From the Windows 8 start screen, go to the desktop, press Windows key and R, type msconfig and click OK. When the window opens up, choose the boot tab and look for a checkbox next to safe boot. Check this. Then select the version of safe mode you want to boot into. Minimal is normal safe mode, alternate shell is safe mode with command prompt, and network is of course safe mode with networking. After choosing the version you want, click OK and then click restart now. Let the computer boom like normal and it will log into safe mode. All drivers will be turned off. No networking, no programs like start date on the desktop taskbar, just plain and simple Windows 8. Now if you restart your computer, you will keep booting into safe mode. So to stop this, press Windows key and R again, type msconfig, go into the boot tab and uncheck the safe boot checkbox. Now when you restart, you will boot into the normal Windows 8. So that's how to boot into safe mode in Windows 8. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you want more videos, subscribe.